was the parrot from Aladdin! Parrots are beautiful tropical birds who can mimic a wide range of sounds with their highly developed syrinx. They're incredibly intelligent creatures that can be trained to hold conversations with humans but in limited capacity. For hundreds of years, they've been encouraged to mimic human languages for our amusement. They became the darlings of the animal kingdom. Children and adults alike adored these birds and they continued to grow in popularity as the years went by. But as with most things, those with money and power began usurping these creatures for their business ventures. They've been featured in talk shows, sitcoms, movies, zoo attractions, TikTok, commercials, and the list goes on. The market was flooded with parrot merchandise. There was a time when you couldn't even cross a single kiosk in any mall without seeing the images of these birds on phone cases and other trinkets. And as with most things, they became victims of diminishing return. With their overexposure in the media came apathy and disinterest from the fans. The once profitable market began to crumble under its own immense weight and so lay waste another empire. Pressured by their investors, these media moguls were incensed to make their money back any way they can. They pulled a plug on all concurrent projects and put these parrots to work. They were all trained to become telemarketers overnight so they could sell diet pills and fluorescent light bulbs over the phone. The parrots were less than enthused about the new direction, but they were sadly still under contract. They weren't too keen on taking on the army of lawyers at their disposal and so they remained compliant. They made cold calls and followed the script as instructed. They could feel their souls being sucked out of them as they faced constant rejections and hostility, day in and day out. After several years, they were finally able to complete their contract with the agency. The parrots became a shell of their former selves, bitter and broken by servitude. Some of them relocated to the tropics, but most of them remained. A lot of them continued to work as telemarketers because that's the only life they knew now. They were too afraid to move forward after seeing their brand being utterly crushed in public. However, some did begin to use their voices to bring awareness to any animal seeking stardom. Parrots created their own podcasts and YouTube channels to share their experience in the showbiz and how it's affected them both mentally and physically. But it hasn't deterred any animals from seeking representation or wanting to break into the business. Media moguls continue to use new animals until they've run their courses and cast them to the wayside. The glitz and glamour of the brightest spotlight continue to draw other creatures despite the parrot's best efforts. All that would remain of their ambitions and dreams are their faces in bargain bins and garage sales. I'm Stepfather Time and this has been another episode of Animal Facts. Stay tuned for more factual animal facts. Have a wonderful animal day.